Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome here to Richmond International Raceway. We are here for the... <laughs> I forgot the name of the race. Uh, Need for Speed 400. Um, the last race before the chase. So this race will decide everything. Twelve dri After this race, the 12 drives will be known for the chase and one of those 12 drives will become the champion. For now we are green flag racing with Larissa Vandervoet in the pole position. And we see some close racing over there with Tessile Jackson and the 12 car Peter Sabiano. And actually Evan Gattuso is on the outside line. The funny thing is, last season it was Lurs or it was uh, Evan Gattuso who was in the lead and who got passed by Tessa Sao Jackson in that final uh, lap. Or no, not the final lap, but bef but eventually that won Tessa the race. It was her third or fourth win of the season. I think it was the four the uh, third one. I'm not sure. Lurs van der Voet pulling away. Michael Jeter and Colin Cropley battling for the caution is out, by the way. And here we have a stack up and indeed we saw there the new car Aileen de Suiter. She's still in that 82 car but this will probably be her last race in that car. Was involved in this. Important thing for Aileen, she's fourth in points. I will uh, note down this championship standings very quickly. We have JC Chris, Evelyn Lauderer and J Jared Steinmist. Top three in points. They are already locked in the chase. Then Aileen de Suiter, Jay Pinter, Derek Land, Sean Howell, Tyler Brown, David Emerson and Michael Jeter are in the top ten. Uh, Roger Holt, Christopher Harley, Trevor Holt, Mason Mood, Noah Meyer, Jackson Phillips, Keith Watson, Ingle Amaliana, Ray Caster, Conan Breen, Joseph Nesto, Evan Gattuso, Colin Cropley, Sam Brady, Dylan Young, Noah Hart and Justin Almendinger in 27th. They can still, uh, they are, they can still all get in the top 10 if they aren't already. And then they have to battle be between that. Oh no, they aren't already because I already mentioned the top 10. They have to battle between that and then Jacob Hart, Logan Smith, Aaron Mason, Peter Saviano, Ryan Anderson, Isaac Smith and Larissa Van der Voet can still get in the top... Wait a minute. They can still get in that top uh, 20. We have something weird going on over here. I'll check that later, but... Oh man, Evelyn Lauder is also involved in the 62 will be her last race. It doesn't matter that much because she's already in the chase. And those before mentioned, um, they can still get in the top 20, then they have to win that race. And then they have to hope that nobody else is wrong. They can still get the wildcard positions. And then Max Power, Hayden Klein, Sam Young, Molly Jeter, Chris Summers, Christine Jeter, Tessal Jackson, last season's champion. Uh, Charlene Van Pelt is not driving anymore and Joe Cole can not get in the chase anymore. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take a look what happened over here. Bring us on our first caution of the day. Ooh, this was very costly because 5th in points and 6th in points, Jane Pinter and Derek Glenn get together over here. This is going into turn number 3 and that puts Jane Pinter around into the wall. That is 5th in points. And then everybody behind, in front of him stacks up. That's... Um, fairly normal. Jane Pinter can get this going. I think he d won't get that much damage anymore. Indeed he won't. So now we'll take a look at what happens um, with the others. Because something here stacked up. Uh, I think it was there with Sam Brady. He got into the 15 car. Oh wait, no, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Oops, wrong button. There, it was Ray Caster. Um, okay, he slides in front of the 21 car or he gets turned by the 21 car. That's... Ooh. Oh, 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 man. He was lucky to not flip over. And everybody else uh, over here gets by. Fairly good. That's where Evelyn Lottery got her damage from. Um, but <laughs> there was more. Because here also some guys, they just try to avoid everything. And that eventually turned them around. And Keith Batson was the lucky one to get out of there alive. But this person did not. There the 26 goes around the 66. 
I will just go through this like this. There's um, Eline Suiten. That means the third, fourth, fifth in points are all involved in this one. And one thing I have to check for a moment because something weird happened over here with max power. And where is the 12 car, by the way? Oh man, something else happened with the 12 car and Connor Breen. Oh my, oh, this was already, okay, they were lucky. <laughs> That's what happened, what caused all the confusion. They wrecked after uh, start finish line. The 12 car moves up the racetrack and wrecks both him and Evan Gattuso, two teammates. Isaac Smith avoided everything pretty good. And they sorted it out. Don't think they got any further damage. They were way back in the back. Oh, close call there. Just an Almendinger. And these guys all had to wait for those two cars. So that's what was up with them. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take you to the green flag. And like a boss, we aren't live anymore. And that's kind of usual for me nowadays. 45 car of Lurs Vandervoet is in first position. Second is Michael Jeter. Third is Colin Cropley. Fourth is Joseph Onesto. Fifth is Sal Jackson. Um, sixth is Peter Saviano, still after wrecking. Seventh is Evan Gattuso. Eighth is Max Power. Ninth is Isaac Smith. And tenth is Mason Woods. So, oh yeah, we have the standings button over here. Eh? Here you can see. Still everybody is in this race, I think. Since the 62 car is in the rear of the field, she's last. Evelyn Lauderer doesn't matter that much to her. And yeah, you could you could have seen that. Larissa Van der Voet trying to win her first race. It is unbelievable. She is, has been oh here comes Michael Jeter though. Oh you gotta be God damn well kidding me. Michael Jeter goes underneath Larissa Vandervoet. Larissa Vandervoet has been here since season one. She has raced all the races and she still hasn't won yet. Has come close a couple of times. Um, she, I think she fi she finished uh, season one in the top ten in points. And she was in a chase in season two. Caution is out again. And now it is David Emerson and Evelyn Lauderer once again. And oops. More trouble. Oh, a lot of trouble actually. That's the 14 car over there. Points leader JC Chris. Well, it's going to get hit by Tessa or by uh, Eline Suite. Although it doesn't matter that much to the 14 car either. Because she's also locked in the chase. And with locked in the chase, I mean the top 10. Locked in the top 10, not the top something else. So Michael Jeter's in the lead. Ladies and gentlemen, take a look at what the brawl is on our second caution of the day already. So this wreck we or this kind of wreck we have seen in season one, but not in season two, I think. Uh, Justin Almending is going to get turned over here by the nine car of Canabreen. Canabreen can still get his in the chase at 22 also, but I don't think it will happen. And then he gets hit by like three people, make that four people, and they all oh, five people, six people. Uh, Evelyn Lauderer came flying in at number 90 car. Joe Cole has not had any luck. I mean, like, Charlene Van Pelt and Joe Cole uh, shared that car, but even if they would have combined the points, they would still... Um, by the way, kind of, or there is the 99 wrecking again. And the 20 car. But even if uh, you co you uh, add up the points of Charlene Van Pelt and Joe Cole, you would have still, he would still be like... 40 points behind 42nd position in point or 41st position in point Tessa Jackson. But we will go on board or not on board. We'll check out with these guys for a moment. Because the six there, they all hit. There, uh, this 06 car goes around. The 14 car hit, uh, avoids everything. There, Conor Breen gets some damage. And there's the Conor Breen. I mean, uh, Chris Summers. And Jacob Hart and the number 90 car, look, they are going to uh, bang it up over here. And there, eventually the number 90 car gets turned oh, into, into Sam Young. None of uh, Sam Young's making what that was. So, ladies and gentlemen, Dave Emerson was also involved. 
Okay. You also plowed into it. Look at this. Oh. Ow. Evelyn Lauder really hit hard. And that was Michael Jeter getting the lead. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take you to the green flag. So, a few people probably retired of that. Uh, we'll check that later. Michael Jeter is now in the lead. Second is Larissa Vandervoet. Third is Colin Cropley. Fourth, Joseph Onesto. Fifth, Tessa Jackson. Sixth is Evan Gattuso. Some lap cars. Now, seventh is Max Power. Eighth is Peter Saviano. Ninth is Isaac Smith. And tenth is Mason Woods. So, there you can see some damaged cars. We'll go through the standings for a moment. I can see some guys lap down. And the 62 has retired. Evenly Lauder has retired. 41 car has retired, probably. He. Uh, oh man, that's going to be close with David Emerson. He's ninth in points. He probably won't make it. And the 11 car is probably also retired. And the 1 car probably also. As we go, green flag racing once again. 11 car, Logan Smith. Uh, oh, he, he won't get in the chase. And also the 1 car won't get in the chase. So, Michael Jeter is pulling away from this. There's a Van der Voet has cleared the 60... Ooh, contact over there. Wow, Aaron Mason has a lot of damage. Oh, God, again a caution. Oh, yes. I have a feeling this race will kind of be like the other uh, short track races with a lot of caution. Oh, Mason Wood got turned. Peter Saviano also involved. Oh man, this is... Oh, JC Chris, points leader involved. Oh well. So, um, we kind of had another big mess. I hoped, it, I hoped that this race wouldn't be that chaotic. But everybody wants to get everything they can before the chase starts. Survival race, once again. Just like the other chase race will probably be. Ladies and gentlemen, take you to what happened over here. Bring us on our third caution of the day already. Oh man, this was pretty bad. Max Power is going to get into a lapped car over here. The number 90 car of Joe Cole. And look at what happens next. Gets into him, slides down, takes out the 12 car. The 29 car, 12 car. Goes head on into the wall. And then he slides down and there you can see Mason Wood spinning. And everybody else here behind piles into it. Well, actually they piled into something else, but... They all start stacking up over here. We'll reverse that for a moment and then we'll go to... Uh, I think something, some more things happened over here. Um, yeah, they just got... Oh man, that is so, that is so bad. They just got together over here. Mason Wood could have saved it. But... He looks oh this okay he gets turned in by the 17 car and this was up front they crossed the start finish line that's good for them and these guys just went through the grass but we also saw 13 points Jared Stein that means all the points leaders have been involved in this one I mean like first in points JC Chris was involved in the wreck Evelyn Lauderay is out of the race Jared Stein was involved Elina Suiter was also involved in a couple of wrecks Jane Pinter Derek Glenn only Sean Howell then uh, did not. We'll take a look at over here. Jared Stymist. Uh, they got to get. Uh, Jared Stymist gets turned here by Inge Lambuliana. <laughs> but eventually Inge Lambuliana got loose. And there's uh, the double zero car slides to a stop. And that was interesting. Who survived this? These guys did. Big, pretty good job over there. They have to slow down. There's Sean Howell, 17 points. So, interesting things over here. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take you to the green flag. No. Once again with Michael Jeter leading. Back again. Michael Jeter is in the lead. Second is Larissa Van Der Third is Colin Cropley. By the way, Colin Cropley... Um, can still get in the chase, he has to win then. 
everybody outside of the top 20 has to win this race, otherwise they won't even make it. Uh, Joseph Onesto, he can... Yeah, he also has to win. Evan Gattuso, um, he, was, uh, he also has to win. Desta Jackson cannot get in this chase anymore. Seventh Mason Wood, he has... Um, he, oh, he's pretty good. He, ha he still has to win, but maybe he can get a good finish. Get in top 10. Isaac Smith in 8th. 9th is Christine Jeter and 10th is Sean Howell. Bad restart for Sean Howell. Look at this. This race will be the 88th. If, those lap if that left traffic stays up there, look at Larissa Vandervoet. Maybe tries to get a good run over here. And I have a feeling... Ah, uh, whoa, they survived it. Oh, at least. Tessa Jackson wants to get a win this season. She has won every season except for this one. Two races she has won in season one. Just, or four, se four races in season two and not a single one this season. And let me guess, the caution is now out. Yes, indeed. How did I know? I have no clue. Oh, it actually just happened. Oh, that was costly. Canabrin. Eline Suiter. Noah Meyer was on pit road. Uh oh. And Aaron Mason went around. And Evan Catuso. With some issues over here, going through the grass. We had like three things go wrong over here. Once again, big mess. Have they sorted it out? Yes. And s all of a sudden, Aaron Mason is in fifth. But then, who's in fourth? Oh, Joseph Vanesto is in fourth. Okay. We have some interesting racing over here. By the way, Tyler Brown is here. He's eighth in points. He's running in tenth position. I think he might be able to get in this chase. And by the way, um, we have little sister of Tyler Brown. Uh, um, oh, I have <laughs> Renes May um, Brown. That's what her name, I think. Uh, she will be in the season next season, or she will be next season then. Um, I already designed her car, but again, I won't design any cars. I saw some people, or one actually one person only, ask about making his car. Well, I will think about it. But I will probably make no other cars because I still have to make like three or four cars. Um, so, and I have like a very limited time. But ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take you to what happened over here. Three wrecks or something. Well, Tyler Brown, <laughs> uh, he was in the top 10. But yeah, with doing these things... I can also get in the top 10 easily. He's going to get, turn Christine Gita over here into the 34 car. And he gets by clean. Jared Stein is involved. Ooh, Jane Pinter, I think he just got a piece of that. And there, Max Power also spins. And Conor Breen gets into it pretty hard. And this is also a hard hit. I will reverse it. I won't. I won't. We'll go on board for a moment with Jane Pinter. That's not on board. By the way, this is a Ford, I think, but it has no Ford logo, so. On board. Oh man, it was close. It was very, very, very close. Helicopter view? That's how close it was. That's how close it was. That's how close Jane Pinter came of wrecking into that. Oh, that is amazing. I will now go to the 44 car. Whoa, I clicked in on onboard, but we won't go onboard with Max Power. We'll go to TV1. He's going to get turned over here. Well, actually, he's going to avoid things. And then he gets, uh, he gets turned by the 89 car. Slides into Ingle and Bliana, Both get into the wall. And then he gets into Conor And spins it around. Conor actually, thank you very much. 
bring some uh, straight again. Then Connor Breen gets thanked by wrecking. And you know what? We'll go to Aaron Mason now. Because something happened over... Oh, another wreck up front. Damn, I was with him. Yes. Okay, look at this. Full speed now. He gets turned by Joseph Esto. That's a very hard hit into the wall. And then something else happened to the two car. He was probably also involved in that. Yes, indeed, there he is. Where's the two there? Having a two, so. Oh man, I almost hit the wrong button over there. Four wide they went, and he decides to, well, get on the apron. That ain't gonna work, guys. And then he gets through the grass. It kind of brings loses a lot of, or uh, Evan Katusa loses a lot of time with this. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take you to the green flag. Right? Oh, he gets hit by the double zero car right now. Oh. Still not live. Surprise, surprise! Almost halfway already. How late is it? <laughs> it's already getting dark over here. Anyway, Michael Jeter is in first position. Second is Larissa Vandervoet. That's not Larissa, but that is. Third is Colin Cropley. Fourth is Joseph Nesto. Fifth, Mason Wood now. Sixth, Derek Glenn. That's what he has to do. He has to get a good finish. He's sixth in points. He has to get a good finish. Seventh, Tessa Jackson. Eighth, Isaac Smith. Ninth, Sean Howell. Tries to get in the chase again. And tenth is Tyler Brown. Very quickly, points stuff. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. The 12 car and the 33 car out of this race, I think, then. The 22, maybe. Oh, that's a heartache for the 22 car. Oh, no. Lane. Yeah, it is, of course, a heartache, but chances were very little that he would get in chase. I think it's more painful for Trevor Holt, who was 13th in points and who go won't get in the chase anymore. Um, by the way, we got some close racing over here. Lap traffic, yes. Issues. Oh, that was so close. More lap traffic. Whoa, look out, guys. Look out, look out. Tyler Brown gets into the 17 car. Aggressive racing. Tessa Jackson now stuck behind the 90 car. She can do this clean or she can do not do this. Oh, it doesn't matter. She cannot also do it. And I wait for the caution to come out, which is out now. And Dylan Young, Jared Stuyvesant, Aileen de Suiten, Evan Gattuso. This has not been Aileen's race. What position is she now? 27th. Well, that sucks. Were these guys actually already under caution? No, they, they weren't. There's a big hole to them, but they were not under caution yet. Uh, they slow down just in time so they can fix this. Look at the damage on the 82 car. And again, a bad uh, break <laughs> for a new car. That means that next next time they won't finish in the top 15. So next time we will not have any new paint schemes anymore. Ladies and gentlemen, Michael Jeter is still in the lead. He has led uh, ever since he passed the 45 car. Larissa van der Voet back in her old paint scheme again. Or one of her old paint schemes. Uh, time to take you to what happened over here, our 5th or 6th caution already. You know what, the fun thing is, Elias Seite was not even involved in this wreck. Yeah, maybe later, but it started off with 11th place, Noah Hart, getting turned around by Evan Gattuso, over here. And there they go, Evan Gattuso also spins, 09 car spins, 99 gets a piece. There goes the 09 car into the wall. And these guys got the worst over here. Ooh, actually Alien did get involved, but then <laughs> um, with not slowing down. So that was avoidable wreck, but that's okay. She got herself with it. There, the 16 car gets into the points lead. No, actually the 13 points. And there, Alina hits him. So Dylan Young with damage, Elena with damage, Evan Tuso with damage, and Jared Stein with damage. Ladies and gentlemen, take you to the green flag while it is raining over here. Mm -hmm. 
So we are back again with Michael Jeter in the lead. Second is Larissa Vandervoet. Third is Joseph von Nesto. Fourth is Colin Cropley. Fifth is Mason Wood. Sixth is Sean Howell. Seventh is Derek Glenn. Eighth is Tess Sanchez. Ninth Tyler Brown. And tenth Isaac Smith. I think that the 19 car has a chance to win this race. All three cars up front have not won yet. Michael Jeter. Who actually closed his account or his account, account was hacked but he will still be in the series just like Molly Jeter and Christine Jeter the three Jeters next season we will have two Browns uh, Tyler Brown and Rennes May Brown ladies and gentlemen Michael Jeter leads them to the green flag again I have to go and put a light on put a light on okay I will put them now 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 I'm back again Whoa, more light. I like light. I don't like darkness. Dark. I actually, with if you look at my music taste, there goes Sean Howell around, and that is painful for him. Oh god, you gotta be kidding me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Caution is out. Sean Howell turn around. And that is a heartache for him. He was 16th. Well, I don't think he was 16th. I think he was in the top 10. Oh my goodness! And the Taco Bell Ford of Sean Howell has a lot of damage. I don't know by who he got turned around. Might as well have been a 21 car, but I'm not sure. We'll take a look at that. Sean Howell, 7th in points he was. Uh, still 19 points in front of 10th position though. And 20 points in front of 11th position. I think he'll be ma he'll manage to be able to stay in the top 10 in points, but I'm not sure. Definitely a bad eight, bad break for him. Ladies and gentlemen, take a look what happened to Sean Howell. Actually, it was Derek Glenn turning him around, and that's the second person Derek Glenn has turned around who is in the top 10. We will consider. Uh, we'll check. We'll uh, keep an eye on the 70 car. He has turned Jane Pinter, who was 5th in points, and now 7th in points, uh, Sean Howell, into the wall. And Jared Glenn is 6th is, uh, in points. Apparently, he really wants to be in the chase that bad that he's going to wreck other people. Um, yeah, if he wrecks one more person, I will. I could give him a penalty. We'll, we'll check on that. But for now, Michael Jeter is still in the lead. Quick replay, try to get it live again. Yes, we are alive again. Michael Jeter in first. Second is Lurse van der Voet. Third is Joseph Nesto. Fourth, Colin Cropley. Fifth, Mason Wood. Sixth, Derek Glenn. Seventh, Tyler Brown. Eighth, Isaac Smith. Ninth, Tessa Ajax. And tenth, Ron Anderson. Mason Wood has to look out because he has Derek Glenn behind him. Michael Jeter. We have crossed two third mark of the race. And who will get a good restart? Lurse van der Voet has a good restart, but nowhere to go. I think Larissa Vandervoet and Joseph Ernesto, as soon as those lapped cars are gone, they could have a pr pretty good chance uh, to get behind that 88 car and pass him. Well, we'll check on the cautions. Oh, trouble, and Errol Mason goes around. Oh, almost gets hit. That means that we have a caution, and, well... They are already on the course, and they aren't. Michael Jeter, Larissa Van der Voet, Joseph Onesto, they want to see a caution within the final 10 laps, so they can get, uh, and then, of course, with not uh, lap traffic be between them, then they could have a great chance. And Chris Summers, lap traffic, he is actually still pretty, far, pretty fast. He's in 27th position, but he's up front over there, racing with the same speed. And something must have happened to Evan Catuso because he's behind Aaron Mason. Yeah, we'll check on that right now, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> something. We have had a lot of. Co it's, apparently, it is short tracks, a lot of cautions, speedways, less cautions. Short tracks, little cautions, speedways, big cautions. Well, last race, or last time's race, yesterday's race at Atlanta, that was a really good race without many cautions, just two cautions. So, we'll check on, we'll uh, see what we'll get. Ladies and gentlemen, 
time to take you to the replay. It must be because of that song I played it in the beginning. Uh, I have a sentence stuck in my head, which is I'll wait, I'll wait for the ambulance to come, ambulance to come. That makes me, or that makes this race have so many cautions that they need an ambulance. Aaron Mason is going to get turned around by Isaac Smith, also up front. And there he goes. Normally it is a little bit earlier, but this time it isn't. And Aaron Mason goes sliding over the uh, start finish line I think caution wasn't out yet when he crossed the start finish line that's a heartache for him he will be behind all the other lapped cars um, then Evan Gattuso okay I'm not sure what happened to him he gets passed by the 66 car it makes perfect sense because the co no that doesn't make any sense at all but Indeed, it doesn't make any sense. So I'm not sure what is that about all about. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take you to the restart. We are back again with Michael Jeter in the lead. Second is Lars van der Voet. Third, Joseph Nesta. Fourth, Colin Cropley. Fifth, Mason Wood. So, ooh, sixth, Derek Glenn. Seventh, uh, Tyler Brown. Eighth, Isaac Smith. Ninth, Ryan Anderson. And tenth is Hayden Klein. Hayden Klein in tenth. Wow. And we have the news that Sean Howell will do it quickly. Here you can see retired. Sean Howell also has retired. Elina has retired. Connor Breen has retired. And you can see the others who have retired. The green flag is out. This may be our final restart, with, uh, which will be double file. That means that Larissa Vandervoet, if she has, wants to have a chance to win this race, she has to clear the 06 car, which she does right now. Joseph Nessa also has to do that, otherwise his chance of winning will probably be over. And Derek Glenn has been passed now. But then of course it won't help if we don't have a caution, but this race has kind of evolved that we will probably have a caution within a few laps. Mm. Almost, almost Derek Glenn. No, oh, caution is out, yeah. Well, we have a wreck. And Derek Glenn, look at how aggressive he is. They are not on a caution yet, but he's really aggressive. He's really trying to get to the front. Almost turned Mason Wood around, but they are clear, clean over here. Look at smoke. Well, we had a pretty big one, I think. We saw the 66 get turned around again. Can, uh, Christopher Harley. We haven't talked about him all day, though. Ingela Maliana. Sam Young. Molly Jeter. Jacob Hart. And there's Aaron Mason. I think he's finally done for the day. At least the 66 car will not be in the chase even though he has won two races and he was the points leader I think at the moment Michael Jeter in the lead but I think Larissa van der Voet and Joseph Van Nesta all have a chance to uh, make something happen over here because we have no lap traffic again they have only one chance though ladies and gentlemen take a look at what happened over here How many times has Aaron Mason been turned around this race already? Like three or four times or so. Well, add another one to it at, uh, at least. Here he gets turned by the 17. 89 goes around. And, ew, actually, 89 does not go around, but he gets hit there. Oh, hard hit. And they all hit pretty hard over here. And look at that. That was a hard hit for Keith Batson again. This is not again of one of those races. He knows what I mean. So, um, one thing I want to mention is that tr uh, Roger Holt I saw right before. Um, where does it happen? There it happens. He blows up and Roger Holt, ladies and gentlemen, was 11th <laughs> in points. He will probably be not in this chase. Just because his engine gave the spirit with 9 laps to go. 
what a heartache for him. And also, Evan Gattuso is making a pit stop. Wow, what a heartache that is for Roger Holt. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to take you to the finish of this race. A piston problem is what took uh, Roger Holt out of this uh, championship contention, at least. Michael Jeter is in the lead. Second is Larissa van der Voet. Third is Just Vanessa. Fourth, Colin Cropley. Fifth, Chris Summers. No, wait. Chris Summers is not fifth. Uh, fifth, Tyler Brown. Sixth, Derek Glenn. 7th Mason Wood, 8th Ron Anderson, 9th Noah Harden, Ryan Anderson, and 10th Isaac Smith. Who will win this race? I think it will be one of those 3 and maybe 4 uh, leaders and maybe just 1. M Michael Jeter has led all the laps so far except for the first uh, like 5 or 6 laps. We go green flag racing with Michael Jeter who gets a great jump and Larissa van der Voet is going to get freight trains. Here comes Joseph Manasso, three wide for second position. Oh, bumping and banging over there, and there goes Tyler Brown around. You gotta be kidding me. Tyler Brown, this might have just. Oh, JC Chris goes around. Tyler Brown might just have ended the race, one, two, ended his chances of keeping himself in the chase. And Michael Jeter has just won this race. We have only three laps to go. We will not go green flag racing anymore. And look at the 77 car in fifth position. What does this mean for championship? 88 car. Um, Michael Jeter gets his first win. Make that that Michael Jeter is in this chase. Wow, what a, what a great race he drove. What a story. I mean, he hasn't shown that ma that much, um, or he hasn't shown that much this season. But he was in tenth. He fought his way up to tenth, and he is now going to win this race. First ever race won by Michael Jeter. Second, Colin Cropley. Uh, is it enough for him to get in chase? No, I don't think so. Third, Joe Onesto. Is it enough for him to get in chase? Don't think so either. Larissa van der Voet could not get into chase anymore. She had to get in top 20 and that, therefore she had to win. No for her. Derek Glenn locked himself in the chase. With 5th place finish. He was 6 in points. Oh, wrong button. Oh, Mason Wood blows up with just one lap to go. Can he keep it on the racetrack? No, 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 no. Mason Wood. Man, you gotta be. If he would have stayed one more lap longer, he was in sixth position. He could have gone in this chase if he would have stayed there, but now he cannot. He won't be in this chase. Mason Wood, one lap short of getting in this chase. That is just sick. That is sick. Ryan Anderson is sixth position eventually then. Um, can he? Is he in? No, I don't think he will be in the chase. No, he won't. Noah Meyer won't be in this chase probably. Uh, Hayden Klein, mm, say no to him. Mm, yes, indeed, say no to him. And Isaac Smith in tenth position. Also no for him. We will go to the finish, ladies and gentlemen, and then after that we will discuss the rather the the rather's, <laughs> the rest or the others. No, we'll discuss the others. Ooh. Here we go. Michael Jeter wins his first ever race. That is just wrong, man. I I would be so it would be so sick for Mason Wood if he would not get in his chase just because one lap. That single lap, that last lap. Finished 23rd. Could he still have a chance? I think it will be a chance. But on the other hand, Mason Wood has already won two races. And he's one of the few. Uh, I think you can consider my, uh, Mason Wood as one being in the chase. And all, even if, it would, if he would not get in this top 10, he would still... Um, get in with the wildcard position but then he won't get the bonus points for the wins although bonus points but doesn't matter that <laughs> not that much chase <laughs> you have to take a look at this first in points JC Chris has retired 26th 
Second point is Aveline Lauder has retired that last. Worst finish for Aveline Lauder ever, I think. Uh, no, he fin she finished that last one other time. Uh, Jared Steinist in the double zero car finished in 21st. He's in the chase, walked in. Then others. Aileen de Sout in the number 43 car. Um, or actually, this time she was in the 82 car. Finished 30 is the 32nd. And Larissa Vanderhoof is doing something interesting. There she goes. Um, I have to see. Because Aileen de Sout, she was. She will get. Oh, I have a dusty calculator over here. But at least it works. <laughs> at least. Yes, it works. And you decide that 304 points. Um, 11 points, but 227 points. That's 32 points difference. Well, I think she will be able to get in this chase. Elina Suite. Uh, yeah, I think Elina Suite is in this chase. Because Roger Hall did not finish. Uh, Christopher Harley uh, at 17th. Well, Trevor Holt then did... Um, not finish. Whoa, 20, Mason Wood did not finish, and Noah Meyer. Then you already have points difference of forty per forty uh, points. Noah Meyer, and she, he also did not finish. So I think Elina Seid will be in his chase, <laughs> but she will be back in the forty three car for sure. Uh, Jane Pinter in the 09 car. He finished in sixteenth position. Is that enough for him to be in this chase? I I think so. Derek Glenn in the 70 car. He's in chase for sure after finishing 5th. But he did turn around 2 cars. That's bad for your image. Will be no penalty though. But he did turn around 2 cars. Who were also on the course to get in this chase. And one of them was the 38 car. Who has retired? Sean Howell. Will he be able to get it, to keep it in this chase? I'm, I'm not really sure about that. Who were the only others? Um, Christopher Harley was the only other. Finished 17th. That is uh, 17th and 14 points difference. I think the I think he will be in this chase. 14 points difference is 82. Yeah, he, Sean Howell will probably be in this chase. Tyler Brown in number 21. Uh, where did he finish? Did he finish? 22nd. Yikes. <laughs> that's that's a little bit bad for him. Dave, although David Emerson did not fit. Tyler Brown maybe just, just with a few points he could have just gone, or gone himself in the chase. Uh, then David Emerson did not finish. He will probably be not in this chase. Since he finished 41st. Uh, well, maybe. Well, you know what? We'll check that later. But the points difference up front is pretty big. Even if you consider JC Chris with 348 points. Death in points. Michael Jeter with 273. That is... Uh, how many points is that? Is uh, 27. Plus 48 is... Uh, um, yeah, 75 points. If I can, if I can calculate it correctly, 75 points difference between JC Chris and Michael Jeter. That's a lot. So, others, um, yeah, we'll now. You know what? I will keep it short. You will see in the end of the video who is locked, who is in this chase, and who is not. Points will be set to. Um, oh. 1000 or 500 I can't remember what I did again I think it was 500 last season I did 500 I think well I'm not really that sure well it doesn't really make a difference because all the others cannot get in this chase or I cannot win the championship even if they finish good because well 200 and 500 that's a pretty big difference so it will probably be 500 points I'll figure it out all that means that this chase is now certain. Well, not really certain since I haven't calculated things, but it is certain if you look at uh, things. You know, I will. Uh, 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 
Oh, I cannot see how many cautions there were. That's, that's too, too bad. Three bad. So, next time we will go to Texas for the Green Bay 500. Just so Green Bay Packers, I think it is the Green Bay Packers, uh, make two touchdowns yesterday or today. I saw today, but it was probably yesterday the game. Um, pretty good. So, Green Day 500 will be a great race. I think Texas is... Watkins Glen, Talladega, Charlotte always are crazy. Texas, last season... Well, I think we'll maybe lower the, dra the drafting distance for the final race just a little bit. But it will still be a survival race. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, for now, I want to thank you for watching. We have just had 12 races, the Need for Speed 400, ended the championship as it used to be, 4 races left. Who will win this championship? It was Inge Lambliana in Season 1. It was Le Tessa Sound Jackson in Season 2. Who will it now be? JC Chris, Evelyn Lauder, Jared Steinmist, Aileen Suiten maybe, Derek Glenn, Shane Pinter, Tyler Brown, Sean Howell, Michael Jeter, We'll see. Or others who are in this chase. Mason Moot. We'll see. By the way, Eileen, or Inga Lambliana finished in 19th. She has won one race. I think she's pretty good with um, getting a wildcard position. And we'll give her, get her in a chase. We'll see what happens there. I will calculate it right now. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to end this thing. The Need for Speed 400 at Richmond International Raceway. I will see you next time. Phillips Cup Series Season 3 2012. Now my iPod is empty. Oh no, it ain't.